Hello YouTube and welcome to another beer review with me, Lord of Mons, or Jakob. Today's beer is another Samuel Adams. It's a Samuel Adams Boston Ale. Um, it's a uh, uh, 5.1 percent. Oh, 4.8 percent. Sorry, in a 355 milliliter bottle. <laughs> Anyways, I have a little something from the homepage. Uh, Samuel Adams Boston Ale was first brewed to celebrate the opening of a Boston brewery. Like Samuel Adams Boston Lager, it was an old family recipe that was rescued by Jim Cock from his father's attic. Samuel Adams Boston Ale, a stock ale, has complex caramel malt character balanced with distinct spicy and herbal hard notes. Our proprietary, our proprietary ale yeast embodies a variety of fruits and Easter notes in both the nose and flavor which are indicative of the style. Stock Ale, one of the few classic beer styles to have originated in the United States, has a strong New England heritage. The, st the style draws its name from the cool stock cellars in which it was aged. This technique imparted a smoothness and body which became the hallmark of this style. Keeping with the Stock Ale style, Samuel Adam Boston Ale is fermented at cooler, almost lager-like temperatures and good condition much longer than most eels. It's also also is cross knit and dry hot. Yeah. <coughs> uh I have had this one uh a couple of times before and it's it's more smooth than your uh, normal ale I remember it as um uh, but we'll see. Uh it's uh half Finger off white head with the color is uh, copperish. Yeah, there's not much to it, it's just uh, not much carbonation either. But uh, let's get the room. Uh, yeah. Uh, I, I get a metallic sort of since right away a little malt um, a little toffee uh, there's not much in it actually but um, anyways let's get this one tasted and cheers guys oh it's uh Uh, there's some toffee notes, uh, a little caramel, very vague caramel taste. The metallic taste that I got is not present at all. I, I'm not sure if uh, if it was from the cat thingy. I don't know. Yeah. Uh, there's not much to the taste. Uh, ah, a little roastedness. Actually, not not that much. It's very vague. It has a little sweet, kind of sweet aftertaste. Uh, a subdued. Um, there's a sweet note to it, actually. Yeah, I don't know. It's it's quite okay actually. It's it's a very refreshing ale. Uh, I had I have had this quite a lot of times actually. It's, a, it's pretty cheap and it's much much better than uh, than most uh, ales. Ah, than most beers I can uh, get hold of for the same price. So uh, it's a very good al alternative to uh, Carlsberg and Tuborg and all the other. Beers I drink normally. Rating wise, um, it uh, 68. I think it's a little better than the than the lager, Boston lager, but it's not the best lager. I I did, don't want to hit it at 70. Uh, it's not the best ale. I don't want to hit it 70. So. Yeah, it's it's very good. Um, if you haven't had this one, go out and uh, try it if you can get one. And it's actually pretty good. 
So uh, 68 for the Boston Ale from Samuel Adams and uh, please comment, rate, watch my other video from last night and check my collab video with Peter and rate and subscribe and uh, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in my next video.